coast with a high rainfall level, we had lots of cancellations of people, especially our future friends, our year one through to year eight. Um, some of them would get three to five games for the season. Uh, so we needed a solution to solve that problem because their medical experience is extremely limited. Uh, we looked at building another gymnasium office at our other gym here and that was going to be $8 million. Then we thought we we'll need something a bit better than that. We inquired around a few other neat centres and found that one in Auckland had two courts covered with a, a shade system of some sort. Went up, had a look really liked it and thought that's exactly what we need except we need walls to stop the rain getting in so that's when we had a discussion with straight system once the structure was finished um, it allowed us to play equal every single saturday we had the cancellation committee gone now we have rugby soccer hockey sometimes um, even people learning how to fly drones hiring the facility in the winter time with a lot of rain, the fields, the training purposes become unsuitable. So the structure is now being used by all codes and all members of the community. And our netball girls and skill level is increasing because they're playing every single Saturday. Uh, we do hire it out at reasonable rates to the codes. We're not there to rip them off, so we're pricing it accordingly and we're making sure that revenue coming in covers the cost long term. I've been involved in sport in the community for a very long time. For 20 years we were trying to establish a sports hub of some kind, somewhere. We realised that we couldn't do it on our own, so we formed a partnership with Houston High School. The chair of Houston High School at that point in time um, decided that we needed to look further in the field, and that's when we went to Auckland and found Jade System Canopy, and that's when our discussion started with what could they do for us. Covering, we looked at the possibilities of covering two courts, four courts, or six. And it came down to covering our four courts, and that's looking further afield. Shea System was really the only solution that could actually handle the size of our project. The additions that we added to the um, system was a speaker system, um, the lighting, making sure we had adequate lighting for people to train right through to 90 o'clock at night. Um, and adding the walls, the rainfall coming from the north or the south and west, we needed all the walls covered in, but leaving the um, east end open. Look, I think it's um, really what has revolutionised the netball for hockey cricket because the weather is so unpredictable, and to be able to say we're going to have netball all winter or all season, the, show, uh, the over you know, protection of the courts is it's really difficult. That's um, you know, made a difference too to have more covered sports. So netball can be played to its um, best, I guess, when you have a lot of weather back. More games, you know, they get a full season in versus cancellations and the climate change in the summertime, it's also protecting from the sun, so it's multi-seasonal benefits.